After the t-shirt has been air dried for at least 24 hours, spread it evenly on an iron board, avoiding any creases. Place a garment right side up or painted side up uh, and cover it with a clean cotton fabric. Not with paper, not with any synthetic fabric, only with cotton. Use iron without steam and make setting suitable for cotton. Iron the painting for 5 uh, minutes continuously or sometimes for some paint brands 3 minutes are, is enough without stopping in one place. Otherwise the fabric might slightly burn or you can see it turns uh, slightly brown or uh, paint might even change its color too if overheated. If painting is too big, iron it in portions. It's important to iron the painted surface, not turning it inside out. The reason is because some fabric paint brands have glossy and sticky finish, which when heated might uh, simply stain the backside of your garment. Also avoid using paper or any other things for iron protection because here too there is a risk that uh, thickly applied paint or outliner can stick to it and when you lift your protective sheet off the paint might also come off. If your paint uh, or painting still stuck to cotton fabric after you've started lifting it up leave it be for a while. Let it cool off. Uh, fabric should cool off completely and then only you'll be able to safely remove the cotton sheet of your painting without damaging it. Otherwise a piece of paint might come off the painting and remain on your protective fabric. So we have settled on the idea that painted design isn't to be touched with an iron and shouldn't be ironed with a steam. You can, however, carefully spray some water or use steam function on your iron when pressing the area around your painting in order to get rid of creases or simply to make your painted garment uh, look presentable for photo session or for your client. We should leave the painting to rest after it's been ironed and restrain from washing it for minimum up to 3 to 7 days if we want our design to stay bright and colorful for a longer time.